Hey everybody, going to make another quick tasker video. This one has to do with um, posting to Instagram. Now, what's what's so fun about manually posting your pictures or video to Instagram? It's not very fun. We have Tasker, so we're going to make Tasker do it uh, with some automation. So let's give it a go. First and foremost, I'm going to show you how this works. I'm just going to do everything by voice, and uh, you'll see right here. Post to Instagram. Photo or video? Photo. And it took the picture, and that's of my screen, my computer. But you know it doesn't stop there here you get two options whether you want to take a photo or video so the tasker program had asked me do you want photo or video in that particular instance I said photo let's try it with video post to Instagram Photo or video? Video. And it switched over to the video. And I did not have Tasker record the video on its own because this is a feature where you hold down and you can pause it accordingly if you want. I want to be able to be in control of that. So I did not get Tasker to do anything further other than this. But I'm going to go into Tasker and I'm going to show you how I did this. It's real simple. Get rid of that. So we're going to open Tasker. And on this one, I created a profile and I named it Post to Instagram. Now, the, the profile um, to trigger this uh, whole ordeal, I called it Instagram and used a regex. So basically when it hears the word Instagram, it launches the task. Okay, you can make it do whatever you want. So on the task, what I did was first and foremost, I launched the Instagram app and then I waited about four seconds. And uh, once four seconds have passed, it's pretty much ready to go. So I added an auto input action at this point. Um, at this point, we're here, okay? So that auto input action, the first one, is to click on um, the little camera icon down below and that indicates whether you want to add a photo or a video so at this point tasker is going to ask me what do I want to use a photo or a video so I we're here now so I waited two seconds and it's, it'll say photo or video and then I'll have an auto voice recognized pop up and it will listen for my answer um, on this second auto voice recognize I used photo with the regex now what that does uh, if I say photo and I added an if here and the if I use the condition avcom equals to photo and what that does uh, it does an auto input action of pressing pressing the button for the photo I'll show you so here it says photo or video if I say photo it's gonna press right here and it's gonna take the photo um, now if I say video it's not gonna do that and it's gonna press here to change it to video and I'll show you that real quick so here if I had said photo, the if AAVCOM equals photo, it will take the picture. 
uh, or if it does not my response does not equal photo basically anything else um, I'll have an auto input action and that basically presses this right here so when it says photo or video if I don't say photo I can say cookies or you know trees or whatever it will press this right here if I say photo it will take the picture like that so that is pretty much it um, I just think this is kind of cool uh, it's really simple really simple little thing that you can you can got you can have going on 